You will become an explorer into the mysteries of life. Why are we attracted to one person and not another? What happens when we confront our darkest fears? Can we ever become young again? What are the limits of human endurance? Celebrate the power of the human spirit in its relentless pursuit of knowledge. The more we know, the more powerful we become. Explorations. On Explorations, Trevor tries to beat his fear of heights with a controversial therapy. In that situation, we won't let you go. Please. <laughs> Jackie confronts her nightmare. A feather. And we meet Ryan, who loves roller coasters, but is petrified of flying. The human race has survived on Earth for many reasons. One of the most important is our ability to feel fear. A primitive emotion which prepares the body to run or fight in the face of danger. When a threat appears, the brain's fear center, the amygdala, snaps into action. It sends signals to the adrenal glands, triggering a massive release of adrenaline. Adrenaline speeds up the heart and makes us breathe deeply, creating a surplus of oxygen-rich blood, which is diverted to our muscles. Now they're charged springs waiting for a decision, fight or flight. This powerful natural instinct is a lifesaver if you're confronted with a deadly threat. But what happens when it goes wrong and turns into a phobia? Jackie Kelly has had an irrational fear of birds and feathers for as long as she can remember. I went to see my doctor and I asked him if there, there was anybody that he could send me to. He looked at me as though I was crazy. Jackie's fear of birds stops her from doing many things with her young daughter. When Angelina wants to feed the ducks, she has to go with her grandmother. Last year when we were on holiday um, in Tenerife, I took Angelina to the beach. One pigeon landed. It was probably about 100 yards away from us, but I couldn't stay. I just upped and legged it. And it wasn't until I got back to the hotel that I realised, God, I've left my child on the beach. She's only three, she's there on her own. Apart from being frightened of the birds and feathers, my biggest fear is something happening to my daughter because of me. But just how intense is Jackie's fear when she sees a feather? She's agreed to be wired up to a heart monitor to find out. Her normal rate is about 80 beats per minute. Oh, God, no, no. But when she sees a feather, her heart goes haywire as adrenaline shoots through her body. Do you want to help? Do you want to help? Yeah. Yep, okay, yeah. can you put the screen up, please? How can anyone be petrified by something as harmless as a feather? The answer probably lies with a traumatic experience Jackie suffered as a young child. On a visit to her grandmother's house, she found herself in a room with a trapped bird. It was just going all around the house, flying anywhere. It was scared, the bird was more scared than we was. But you was terrified. This trauma created powerful links in Jackie's brain between feathers and danger. The resulting phobia threatens to condemn her to a life indoors, away from birds.